Although we know that the pivot table values are in dollars, currently they're difficult to read because of all the decimals. Let's format the total sales value to show as currency. In the pivot table builder, click this icon on the average of total sales button. Then click number. Choose currency with two decimal places. Then click OK and OK again. Now all of the average sales amounts appear formatted as currency. If any of the values appear as pound signs, just drag the border between the columns to increase the width. Now let's apply a quick style to the pivot table to give it a different look. Let's go with this one. And finally, if you ever change any of your source data, for instance, say you change the wholesale price of this backpack. Now back on the pivot table tab, click refresh to make sure that the pivot table reflects the changes in your data. So those are some of the ways that you can use pivot tables to analyze and summarize your data. Pivot tables are a powerful and useful feature of Excel that lets you quickly cut through huge volumes of data to find just what you're interested in. To learn more about pivot tables and data analysis, check out Help and the Office for Mac website for additional videos, tutorials, and content.